Hey, good morning. This is Clay with Sharp Car Company. Today we're working on a 2009 Ford Expedition with the 5.4. Uh, what we're doing is showing you how to remove and install the uh, starter bolts. I've already taken the starter out. Um, I'm putting the starter bolts in, but I got to thinking, I was like, you know, this might be difficult for somebody to figure out. Uh, take some pretty simple tools. Uh, what we're going to do is, you'll see that my... Uh, wobble is up in there already and I've already tightened down them two bolts but this is also how I extracted them and I'm gonna pull this out and show you how to uh, get this this socket and extension up in there and if this video is helpful please like or share it or give me some comments you know I mean if it's not uh, I don't know what to tell you but I but I think it will be so so what I've got is grab my light so you can see so I have my 13 millimeter on my long extension now it's two parts and I did that on purpose because sometimes you can't get the angle quite right but what I'm gonna do is gonna put it up in there hopefully so we're gonna put it up the back side of the starter Get it up to the top of there. Now I've got it up in there. Um, and you're gonna be able to push it to the side. And how you're gonna how you're gonna accomplish this is you're gonna stick your hand in between the rack and pinion and the axle there, and you're going to put a little bit of grease on the tip of the socket there, and then you're gonna stick your bolt in it, and then guide that to the back top hole. It's gonna be hard to get the top hole in there, so that's why I say that's how I do it. Uh, obviously, you'll be able to get to the front of it through. I've got the apron undone so I can you might not be able to see it but it'll once you get it on the bolt and everything and it's stuck on there you'll be able to apply pressure to hold the bolt in um, and that's kind of difficult and would be almost impossible for me to hold the phone and do it at the same time but hey if this was helpful and you liked it uh, please write me a comment send me an email if you got any questions or want to see me do something I work on a lot of different cars here so I do a lot of stuff have a great day and thanks much for viewing